out-of-pocket costs for Americans with neurologic conditions have risen rapidly over the last 12 years. A new study out says that doctors need uh, better access to drug price information. Yeah, in today's Health Minute, James Dinan explains why. In 2004, someone with multiple sclerosis may have paid $15 per month out of pocket for their medication with a private insurance plan. But just 12 years later in 2016, that same patient was shelling out $309 each month. That's because the prices for neurological drugs have been skyrocketing. According to a study published in the journal Neurology, the out-of-pocket costs for multiple sclerosis medications are 20 times higher in 2016 than in 2004. And it's not just MS patients feeling the squeeze on their wallets. Researchers looked at out-of-pocket costs for more than 912,000 Americans with dementia, epilepsy, MS, and Parkinson's disease over a 12-year period. Each of these patients took at least one neurological medication and were privately insured. And each of these people saw big price increases during that time. The biggest price jump began in 2015 and continued in 2016. Researchers say doctors need to be aware of the costs so they can best advise and prescribe for their patients. The lead author of the study says expensive medicines could affect how often the patients actually take their prescribed dose. For today's Health Minute, I'm James Dinan.